You can define the layer of data you want to see on the run screen. If running application control and more than one channel, you can configure layers viewable for each control channel. To define the layer you want to see on the run screen, select the layers icon. If running a multi-channel control system, be sure to have the control channel selected that you want to display the layer for first. The available layers you have to choose from will depend on the system configuration. With application control enabled, the available options will be coverage, which is the basic coverage layer of application, speed, which is a map view of ground speed, height, which is a map of elevation, GPS, this is a map that will indicate the type of GNSS correction that is being used, for example, showing an area of RTK fix or when the system has dropped back into exfil mode. Cross track error is a map that will represent where the vehicle has been holding the line and where the vehicle has been experiencing cross-track error. Guidance is a map that will represent the vehicle's engaged or disengaged status. Applied rate, if applying application control, this will be the actual rate that the material has been applied. Target rate, this will be the set target rate either from the run screen or commanded from a variable rate prescription map. You also have the ability to adjust how the layer is displayed on the run screen. To do this, press the gear icon and then select the layer you want to adjust the settings for. By default, the coverage layer is not able to be changed. Set the minimum and maximum range as well as the number of steps within this range. If you are running prescription maps, you may need to come into the target rate layer and adjust the minimum and maximum to match that of your prescription map. You can also change the colour scheme to best suit your requirements. With the adjustments made, press the OK button and the changes will be applied to those layers. 